Hi guys, if you're getting this error, this DL file missing error on Windows computer, here is the fix. What you have to do, you have to just open any browser. And now what you have to do, you have to search this DLL file along with download keyword. Okay. Now download the file, just go inside this website the top search result and now download the file now here uh, the architecture 32 and architecture 64 both have a different download links so first you have to determine your system architecture type for that what you have to do you have to just search system information and click on system information and just locate system type if it is x64 that means your architecture is 64 bit pc if it is x86 or anything other than this uh, other than x64 that means you have 32 bit pc so in my case it is 64 bit pc so i will download it most of the modern computers are 64 bit if you have a 32 bit pc download the 32 bit okay now once it gets downloaded after that just extract it on your computer now once you have extracted it just copy the DLL file now just go to C then go to Windows now just locate system 32 folder okay now there are two folders here system32 and syswav64 for 64 bit pc you have to paste this file in system32 folder if you have a 32 bit pc you have to paste in syswav64 in my case my pc is 64 bit so i'll paste it here just paste it click on replace the file in the destination and if this prompt appears and just you're good to go if this doesn't work you can restart it also now if this does not work you can do one more thing and that is just google visual c++ redistributable okay and make sure this is a microsoft.com link latest supported visual c++ redistributable downloads just click on it and here also you will find download link for different architecture so if whatever be your system type my is x64 so i will download this if you have 32 bit you can download this okay just download it and install it on your computer after that restart and see if your problem has been fixed or not that's it guys please do like the video to support us and thanks for watching the geek page